both the Air Force and the NFL are both elite teams. Whether you're in the NFL, you're trying to be the best in the world, and the Air Force is trying to be the best in the world. Performance, it has to be 100%, it has to be on point, and you're constantly getting stressors, whether it's a coach or it's that colonel above you who expects you to have the job done and the job done well and on time. You have to attack things that are challenges in life. Those easy things in life that you can complete, they don't mean anything. But if you go through something challenging, something that was so difficult, that it was mentally, physically, spiritually tough on you. Those are those things that you remember when you're old. You're like, wow, you know what? Me and my boys, we went through basic together. We went overseas together. We were part of an elite team and we were the best. It's that stuff in life that means the most to you. Not only do you have to be on top of your own stuff, but you gotta look out for your team members. You've seen other guys struggling. You gotta be there for them. You gotta know them. You gotta help them out when they need help. They're dealing with the same problems, the same issues. You're not alone. And the fact that they'll be there to help you, it's a team and it's a family. And it's gone through stuff together that no one else can understand. With the touchdown, and there's the record. Do the best you can. You're going to get knocked down sometimes. But the beauty is getting back up. Sometimes you don't want to get back up, but you got three hands out there waiting to pick you back up. And that's about beauty, about being part of a team and being part of the Air Force.